All right, first graders, we are going to jump right into our CKLA, which is Core Knowledge Language Arts, CKLA, Skills to Reader, and this is called GRAN. So GRAN is a shortcut way to say grandma or grandmother, and this is GRAN. Now, one thing that I want to point out to you is, so here's a table of contents with all of the stories that are in this book. And one thing I wanna point out to you is that when you are looking at the words, you'll notice that some words have underlines. Um, sometimes it's just a digraph or a blend or one letter that is underlined and the underlines mean that it's a tricky word or it's something that um, it's something that's a little bit tricky and maybe doesn't follow all of the rules that we've been learning. Another thing you're going to notice is letters that appear in bold print. The words and letters that appear in bold are patterns that we are following and learning about in class. So pay attention to the underlines and the bolds. Grand's trips. When will Grand get here? Josh asks. Jen shrugs. Just then, Josh and Jen see a cab on the street. Grand is here, Jen yells. When Grand steps from the cab, Josh and Jen run up to get a hug. Was the trip fun? Josh asks. Which one? Gran asks. I went on three trips. Where to? asks Josh. One was to the Swiss Alps, says Gran. In the Alps, there were steep cliffs. I went up to the top of one cliff, but it was slick. I fell and had to cling to the rocks. No, says Jen. Yes, says Gran. Here is a snapshot. What was the next trip? Josh asks. I went to Hong Kong, says Gran. What is in Hong Kong? Lots of stuff, says Gran. In Hong Kong, I met a man who sings and has wings on his back. No, says Josh. Yes, says Gran. Here is a snapshot. What was the last trip? asks Jen. I went to the Gulf to swim with the eels and feed the fish, says Gran. No, says Jen. Yes, says Gran. Here is a snapshot. Which trip was the best? Josh asks. This one, Gran says. The one where I get to see Josh and Jen. <laughs> 